Good afternoon, Grace Covenant. <clears throat> that melody was a new tune in our hymnal. We have sung it before. And uh, the, the tune, the, the text with that tune is, what is the world like? What is the world like when God's will is done? I was reading earlier today for the lectionary <clears throat> and this hymn came to mind because of the parables of Jesus in the book of Matthew. One of our readings for this week coming up on Sunday from Matthew is found in the 13th chapter and I will just read two verses and many of you will know this. He put before them another parable. The kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed that someone took and sowed in his field. It is the smallest of seeds, but when it has grown, it is the greatest of shrubs and becomes a tree so that the birds of the air come and make nest in its branches. He goes on to tell a number of parables. And this hymn actually grew out of some of those. You'll recognize the stories. <clears throat> Listen with fresh ears to this text, What is the World Like? by Sally Ann Morris. What is the world like when God's will is done? Mustard seeds grow more than we can conceive. Roots thread the soil. Branches reach for the sun. This is how God moves us each to believe. What is the world like when God's will is done? Witness the wandering child coming home. Watch as the parent breaks into a run. This is how God longs for us when we roam. What is the world like when God's will is done? No more is neighbor just ally or friend. Peace thrives in places where once there was none. This is how God works when rivalries end. 
What is the world like when God's will is done? Ready for feasting, we watch through the night, tending our lamps till the new day's begun. This is how God readies us for the light. These are the stories that Jesus imparts, filled with the Spirit who joins us as one, born through our voices, our hands, and our hearts. This is a new world where God's will is done. Grace Covenant, as I think about this text and I think about our living in a pandemic, when I think about the struggles of immigrants and of minorities, when I know how we work to take a stand for Black Lives Matter and how we continue to learn about our own racism, our own embedded uh, racism that we need to confront. Uh, when I look at the news this week and I see that men in power still use that place of authority to demean women and try to diminish their role and influence. I pray for a world where God's will is done. What is the world? What is the world like when God's will is done for the immigrant, for the minority? What is the world like when God's will is done and we move towards racial equality. What is the world like when men finally treat women with respect? What is the world like when neighbor reaches across the aisle and tries to foster peace and conversation? Oh, that we could plant mustard seeds and nurture their growth so that God's will could be done in this world. Don't grow weary, Grace Covenant. The kingdom of God comes with every action we do, with everything we speak, with the work of our hearts and our hands. We are moving closer and closer to what the world needs to be like when everyone shares the vision and the hope and the dreams of God's peaceable kingdom. What is the world like when God's will is done, we will all be as one. I long for that day. I work every day not to tire with the news and the frustration that the world still isn't where it needs to be. But I know that I have a part in making a difference. And I know that you have a part in making a difference. And I know the work that we do together continues to move us closer to that beautiful vision and that reality that we hope to achieve, a world that God envisioned. Continue to stay home if you can, Grace Covenant. Stay safe, stay connected, and know that you are loved. Thanks be to God.